Hey guys, it's Elise, and today I'm coming to you at the witching hour. Um, no, for real. Speaking of witching hour, I'm gonna show you guys how to do this look because Halloween in October. Um, Guess what the f just happened? The camera failed. No. That f got f stomped louder right the f under me and the whole floor just f shook. Again? Yes, like it was louder than the first time. And like my camera was recording. Oh, so it got your reaction? Yes. <laughs> oh my god, like I just got so hot. Oh. I just got so hot. I'm. I was like in the middle of a sentence, and it was like boom. I was like, oh, <laughs> y'all, I'm scared. <laughs> Why? <sighs> I probably shouldn't have did it at this time. Yeah, knowing that they be out. Cause I'm talking about like the whole floor just shook. Like, I don't know what else that, that could have been, cause... I can't even tell you that one. Exactly. I'm literally just sitting here, and there's nothing else over here, except for these two chairs and my makeup. There's nothing else on the floor, ain't nothing dropping, nothing. Oh, wow. What am I supposed to do now? I'm still gonna do this video, but God... Take two. So apparently, we live in a ghost house. I guess they wanted to say hello, but my nerves are already bad. I don't have time for this at all. Subscribe to Sully. Mm -hmm. No, she got that cheek. Subscribe to Sully. You know you wanna see. <laughs> you know you want to sleep. Hey! Back to this makeup look. It's a little face chart I created. Well, I didn't create the face chart. I just colored on it. And I'm also going to be reviewing these CoverGirl True Blend products. This was all through Influencer. Okay, first things first. I used this CoverGirl True Blend Base Business skin primer right here and it is really good first impressions yeah so now i'm just gonna take the um covergirl true blend concealer in the shade golden amber and prime my eyelids with this My thoughts on this, it's really creamy and it doesn't like get thinner as you, um, you know, blend it out. I got a frog in my throat because I'm scared. <laughs> That's what October is about, right? Scary stuff. I like being scared, but just scare me from a distance. No, I can't. Like, my nerves are bad. They're bad. Bad. The palettes we're using today are all BH Cosmetics Color Festival Aurora Lights and also Take Me Back to Brazil. First, gonna go in with this Color Festival palette and I'm going to use this color right here, Haze. This cream color, Focus. 
pack this on here before we buff it out. In the back of my head, I'm just hoping like nothing else pops off. Like y'all see how red my ears are? That's just like, panic! <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> please y'all, don't, uh, hey, please. Okay, I'm black. So now after we've done the electric green eyeshadow and blended it up, we're gonna go in our Take Me Back to Brazil palette. And I'm gonna try to make this green right here work and I'm just gonna pack that right in this crease and then kind of wing it out. And now I'm just gonna buff that out just a little bit. But I'm also gonna pack some more back in there as well. Now we're just gonna um, go in with our concealer and lay down the orange. So after I lay down my concealer, I'm gonna put this orange right here. Just gonna take the same concealer and wipe a little bit on the brush and carve it out. Pack down the orange on there. And now to do the other side. Don't ask me why I chose these colors. I don't know. Let me finish my face and we'll come back to do, well not finish my face, but you know, do the base of my face and I'll come back to finish the eyes. 
Okay, so what I'm going to do now is just go under and take both of those greens and put them under here. Now we're gonna go back in this color festival palette and take this pink called Sequin right here and put it in the inner corner. And we're also gonna use it to contour. And put that right in the inner corner and kind of blend it. First, I'm going to go in with my regular contour just to add some shadows before we put the pink down. Dang, I don't even want to put this on face. <laughs> but first, I'm going to start off with it right here. It's like heavy blush first. Kind of bring that all the way up there and like that. Boom. Y'all know I love blush. Wow, I look crazy, but I guess that's what Halloween is about, huh? I guess I'm just gonna take the brush that I used for my eye then. Wow, look at me. So I'm gonna go in this Aurora Lights palette to add some shim shim shimmer. My other camera died. So I'm just gonna hope that I'm in focus and in frame. Oh, my eyeliner looks trash. <laughs> I forgot what I was doing. What else do I have to do? Oh, do the designs on my face and um, put my lipstick on. I'm going to use this eyeliner, e.l.f. eyeliner, to draw the little candies on my face. Now that I look even more crazy, the last thing we have to do is um, put on our lipstick and throw on some highlighters. The highlighter I'm going to use is the CoverGirl True Blend Super Stunner. It's freaking 4 o'clock in the morning. I would have been done with this, but y'all know. I'm going to just do my lips.
Okay, let me put on my eyelashes and we'll be done. Okay, guys. Finally done with this look. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial and the little paranormal activity that went on beforehand. I guess it's really cute. Call me the candy witch. I'm a good witch and I give you good candy. Or do I? Or which candy is it? Mm. Okay, let me stop. It's 4.15 in the morning. I need to go to sleep.